Hello, what is up everyone? My name is Luna, as if you already do not know. Welcome to... I was about to say Animal Crossing, and it's been like a month or two since I've recorded that. Jesus. Welcome to Explorers of the Sky. Uh, we're four... Three-fifths of our way done with this wonderful journey that is ex EOS. I have a haircut, I'm sick, it's cold out, my hands are cold, they're shaking. Here comes Team Charm, everyone. Will I voice act? I have absolutely no idea. I feel gross. One evening. On the eastern horizon. In a small expanse of ruins. Oh, hey. Raise your hand up, grappler. Haha, this is. This is the deepest part of the dungeon, I think. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Hey! There's nothing you can say! There's a treasure just up there! Don't tell me! Don't tell me this is a treasure everyone's been blabbering about! It is! It has to be! This is the treasure of these ruins! Ugh. I've been working hard as an explorer for a really long time. And finally, finally I found what I've searched for. An awesome treasure. This totally rocks. Can't wait. Oh darn. The moment I lift up this treasure, I'm afraid the ruins will start to crumble. Phew, glad I thought of that. I was so excited I almost got careless. Anyway, I'll pick up the treasure carefully. <sighs> Why can't you just open it and take... Well, what do you think? <sighs> It could be like a shitload of pokey coins. Like, what do you really think of it? Cause it's like, most of the stuff in the dungeons is like a single item. And boy, does my nose feel stuffy. Jeez, it's the worst it possibly could be right now. Then I'll run as fast as I can out of here before it crumbles down on me. There's no mistake. The treasure is. The treasure is mine. It's the three girls right there. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What? What was that? That voice! The treasure has already been claimed by us. We're not handing it over to you. Who's there? Where are you? Show yourself! Hehehe! <laughs> show yourself, you say? Alright, we'll show ourselves. Strength! Knowledge! Beauty! Here comes the treasure hunters! Here comes Team Charm! What's this? Ah! It's suddenly too dark to see! Aw oh, man, they use that solar flare. But doesn't solar flare make it so bright that you can't see? Shh, you can find it. Shh. Ah, treasure's gone. Blast. I've been tricked. It's them. Ah, it's coming down. Oh no, all my feels. <laughs> my feels are coming down on me. <laughs> oh, good enough. Cold. All right. <laughs> that went well. The treasure of the ruins is ours. It was a pretty easy job, wasn't it? The one victory right after another. That's right. So they stay there like statues, just so they can trick that one guy. These people are bitches. That's right. We haven't lost out on a treasure we've aimed for yet. Not even one. Team Char has a 100% success rate, and we take pride in that. What is this, some fucking Yu-Gi-Oh card deck bullshit? Isn't that what that stupid guy in the dueling tournament in the Battle City arc? With uh, the, en the Enzo, or the Jinzo, the fucking psychic guy? My deck is flawless. Alright, let's go on and go undefeated. That's I watched Yu-Gi-Oh back in the day, I watched all the way up until DX, and I kind of watched it in 5Ds a little bit. But, eh. You notice how Yu-Gi-Oh! got a little bit hardcore, like the original, like, the, I, not, not, I guess you could say the original. Well, Yu-Gi-Oh! was hardcore to begin with, if you, re if you read the manga. People fucking died in that shit, it's weird. We're the treasure hunters, Team Charm, among the three of us. There's nothing we can't do. La Honey Porn. Special Episode 4, here comes Team Charms. Oh! My gender boundaries. 
This game's for girls. Why are you playing this? Slowly getting a flashback way back when I played uh, uh, Fantasy Harvest Moon 3. Goodness. This game's girly. I still get comments on that. Jesus. People are like, if you think this game is girly, blah, 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 blah. the treasure hunter, thumbs down if you want the uh, thumbs up if you want the attitude arrow back. Team Charm are a very famous exploration team. They are not only famous for being master rank and having a great reputation, but also for their splendid ability to find treasure which is admired by everyone. However, this story takes place a little earlier. It's a story that takes place before Team Charm became famous. The team charm that always gets the treasure they're aiming for. Their next target is... Wait! For me! Ha! <sighs> ha! <sighs> We've come pretty far! And tried so hard! Are we anywhere near our destination yet? Just a little farther, better champ. According to my research, once we get out, out of this jungle, our destination is Boulder Quarry. Didn't we go there before? Deep in Boulder Quarry, there's supposed to be a legendary treasure. It's said to be so beautiful that mere words can express it. Beautiful treasure. Sounds like it will fit us perfectly. Get it? Because they're girls. And girls only care about beauty. Get it? Do you get it? Do you get the stereotype? What's wrong with me? Is that so? When I hear that, it makes me very happy. Alright, let's do our best to get go through this jungle. Um. Um, uh, Who are you? I'm Belosom. I didn't know Belosom looked so fucking stupid. It looks like a thumb with a face drawn on it. Look at it. <laughs> I live in this jungle, do you now? I live on the earth? <laughs> if you're talking about treasure in Boulder Quarry, you really should give up. What? Why? The treasure has been sought by many exploration groups, but so far nobody's found it. Everyone knows that it's impossible to find. And lately, we, that is, those of us who live here, think they might not actually be anything there to begin with. So, don't you think you should give up as well? <laughs> Thank you, Blossom, but we're not giving up. Huh? Not keep up. We will not keep up. In this situation, everyone, that kind of treasure sounds exactly like what uh, the kind of thing we like to look for. We always find and acquire the treasure we're looking for. After all, we all learn treasure hunt. Team Charm. Hey, can you force? Hey, Lop Bunny. Once you've prepared, let's head out to the other side of the jungle. The special episode Here Comes the Charm starts stars Lop Bunny as the main character. You progress to the story with Lot Putty as a playable character. Oh yeah, I'm fucking cute as shit. Fucking cute. Yeah, fuck this cute thing. God damn it. Fuck it. Fuck it. It's ears. Yeah, weird Vera sex. <sighs> Kids watch these videos. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Do I remember how to play? It's been a while. Oh, I gotta hear people going, oh, 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 upstairs. Wow, holy hell, what level am I? 32. Hey, you guys, you noticed in that last episode that I played, I magically turned level 80. And that's what I was talking about when I gave myself the boost and I accidentally let myself boost to level 80 instead of, you know, like level 40 where I wanted to. How'd you do that, Luna? Well, I don't set it the level. I, I, I don't set the level at all, but, uh... If that's what you're talking about. Thanks you for making me recur, recur, recur. Get my PowerPoints back. You're very, very sexy. Fuck you. Boom. Ba 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 boom. Boo. Return's a pretty good move. What? This is bullshit. Uh, jump kick? Don't I hurt myself if I miss? 
it's super effective because it's a fighting type move. This is a part steel type? Or no, no, I believe this is all steel type, isn't it? All steel type Pokemon. I'm not very familiar with it, actually. I believe it's third generation? If I'm not mistaken. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm pretty sure it is. Like I said, the third generation of Pokemon is not really any that I, 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 I fuck with, I guess you could say. It's not any of the Pokemons that I deal with, really. Uh, I wasn't really into the- What the hell's going on? He flunked me! He flunked me! That's right, use Magic Leaf, baby. Magic Leaf on everything and everyone. What is going on? Stop. Stop walking into that tile. Okay, we're doing pretty good, everyone. More team members mean more chance of Luna's survival, right? Or more chance of Luna being fucked over by one of those pieces of sh- What the f- That was a late react. No! Haha, fuck you. Okay, take him out. Take him out! Move up so it doesn't- Jesus! I still haven't seen a Blossom here. You say you fucking live here, but you don't- you don't show up, bro? You don't show- oh, these guys have IQ skills. I just noticed that. They're activating every once in a while. Oh. You take care of it. Take care of it. Take care of it. There you go. We're good. Thanks for using Wish. Why are you using Bide, you stupid? You stupid, it does damage, but no. Now you're poison. Look at you, you're so stupid. I could never move diagonally. I never could. I believe if you press Y and you kind of just, you know, move. <sighs> Wish grants HP and power points, right? Either one of those, if I'm not mistaken. No wonder tile here. My Wonderwall. I heard that song. Wonderwall. I hated that song when I first listened to it, and then I listened to it like 7,000 times because I kept playing on Pandora. I was like, ugh, fine, I, I guess I'll like this song. I don't know. It, it's kind of catchy, but not really. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the band called Oasis. Apparently they're a big deal, bro. But I, I never heard of them, but that's coming from someone who never really listened to that much music other than rap music for a majority of his life. Because white people be whack, yo. We have all know the stories of Luna being scared of white people and not liking white people. <laughs> because he lived in a minority and wasn't accustomed to the majority, I guess you could say. All the... <laughs> All the light-skinned peoples. You can listen to all those stories on Animal Crossing. <laughs> God. Let's see. You're my wonder. Boom. Lop honey. Per ugly. God, can you- I don't even- ugh, They're screaming like dummies upstairs. Uh, if I switch to Gardevoir, can I fly over everything? The bad weather's hurting me. Wait, what's the weather? Fuck. It's okay. I thought it was just sunny. Oh no, it's dust. Dust this- Dust. Dust in the wind. Southern jungle. Why does this have like 5,000 levels? Jesus. Yelling like dummies upstairs. And I'm the one down here <laughs> recording a video game like a normal person, right? Who the fuck watches video games online? Oh, wait, I do. Well, I used to. Actually, I don't really watch a lot of videos anymore. I kind of stopped watching YouTube because I just, just, I don't know. I, I don't know. Ever since I started doing YouTube, I just, like, slowly losing interest in watching anything YouTube wise. And plus, people are starting to have this. Oh, you watch this person? <laughs> well, this person's more better at this. Blah, 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 blah. I remember talking to someone about some event that happened, right? Fuck. 
Fuck. Fuck. What? Ah! Oh! I didn't know he was getting hurt till I was over there. Damn it. Anyway, as I was saying, but I remember I was talking to someone. Uh, I think it was just like a random subscriber on Skype. And uh, they were talking about something like a, a popular YouTuber who, re who reviews games, and he's kind of credible. Random fucking snow here? What is going on? Murkrow! I actually really like Murkrows. I really do. I like Honkrows. Honkrows are good. Uh, no, I was talking to this person, and they are talking about something that happened in gaming and stuff like that, and they were talking to me about it, and they're like, oh, yeah! Blah 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 is like this, and he was so angry, and he was talking about it. And one majority of the YouTubers who are reviewers and they're kind of old, everyone has gimmicks. If you guys haven't noticed, it's a uh, either extension from their personality, which is which all YouTubers are. Not all YouTubers are like 100% like they are in videos. I guess you could say. There may be some that are, maybe some that are not, but it's usually just your personality turned up to like 5,000. Uh, but, oh, we made it here. But pretty much this YouTuber was saying something, and I remember I said it to him earlier. And he was like, is this, what he said is awesome, he's so cool, blah, blah, blah. I was like, I just said the same exact thing. And they're like, no, but he said it's awesome, fucking, Voldy, he's so cool. I guess if you weren't talking to me here and I said that and I had like a million subscribers, I guess you would think I'm fucking awesome. I'm telling it to your face. <laughs> Me and him said the set said the same exact shit. <sighs> this person fails a lot in a video game, so I'm not gonna watch him because I never fail. Ever. Never. I get everything right. I think we reached the other side of the jungle. Pretty sure of it. Seems like we're out of the southern jungle. So, Moldacrory is just ahead, right? Was <laughs> we're we gonna fight Article and Moltres and Zapdos? Huh? I think I heard some kind of strange noise coming from over here. <laughs> I heard it again. Let's go check it out. S someone's unconscious. What is that? The fuck is that? He's not moving. What the fuck? Oh, wait, no, that's Wigglytuff, isn't it? Not moving. It can't be. Huh? Oh, is he? But he's not moving at all. Oh, no. Lopunny, Gardevoir. What, what do we do? What do we do? <coughs> Did he pass out from hunger, I'm guessing? Th that sound again. We heard it coming from over there. <coughs> Is that from... It looks like he just passed out from starvation. Metachan, that's his stomach growling, by the way. <laughs> that was kind of right. But that's how my stomach growls. Huh? You guys are weird. Metachan, try to give him one of those... Got it! I'll put down and see. Next to the conscious Pokemon, Metachan place. An extraordinary, delicious, perfect apple. Oh, that's where you got his love for perfect apples? <laughs> Uh, what? What? That smell! This delicious. It's a tiny bit sour. But of course, sweet! The smell! I knew it! A perfect apple! Crunch, 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 chop, 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 crunch, crunch, chop, gobble, gobble, gobble. Wah! Thank you so much. It was really delicious. Oh, I want to mention someone. Someone messaged me recently. Alright. They messaged me recently about Wigglytuff's voice and how I should change it. About how it doesn't fit him and characteristics and all these things like that. I find it interesting that people take time to do that because, like, they generally. They, they kind of genuinely care about the playthrough in some way. But it's, like, it's so weird. Like, none of the voices I do are serious, I guess you could say. I never do it seriously. All just for me to entertain myself in this sh shitty, shitty gameplay I'm starting to hate. Thank you. I'm feeling better thanks to you. Perfect apples are my number one favorite food. You, you like perfect apples that much? Here, you can have mine too. Really? 
Lop Honey gave me the mysterious Pokemon a perfect apple. Thank you so much! Yay! We're the Treasure Hunters, Team Charm. And you I? Yep. I'm Wigglytuff. Ah, I'm the first apprentice of the explorer Armadalo. Armadalo. Fernando. Wigglytuff, nice to meet you. I never heard of an explorer Armo Armaldo. Armaldo. But <clears throat> if you're saying an explorer apprentice, they'll tell me you're also looking for treasure in the quarry. It's it's no joke. We're the ones who are going to find that treasure. Treasure? What are you talking about? I was just walking through here, that's all. And then suddenly all my food items were stolen by someone. They got really hungry and used up all my strength. And passed out here, that's all. <laughs> oh, is that... If that's it, that's fine. He's such a strange explorer. Well, let's hurry up on ahead. See you later, Wigglytuff. Take care. Thanks again so much. What is he gonna be the boss? Friendly friends. <laughs> he never forgets friends. Would you like to save your adventures? Why, thank you. I would like to save all the bitching I have done. <laughs> 